Are your dog or puppy chewing his tail, gnawing, or biting at the base of his tail? Does your cute dog try to chase its tail? In this video, you will know the reasons and solutions for this issue. It could be a game for you or those watching your dog or puppy rotating like a toy. However, if your dog nips its tail or chews its tail, maybe your dog biting his tail is due to some skin allergy or infection. Therefore, this is not normal for your dog. There are many possible reasons for a dog to behave like this. The very common cause of dogs keep biting tails and chew is fleas or ticks. There is a serious chance that your dog's tail may have fleas or ticks. Therefore to get rid of fleas and ticks, your dog constantly bites or chews its tail. Excessive biting tail and chewing cause further itching in the dog's tail. You must have noticed that your dog bites or nibbles on the tail only at a specific place. It is likely that fleas are irritating your dog in that particular place or the dog tail get an infection. There is another possibility that the dog's tail has developed a wound due to some injury. Your dog's tail also starts looking odd as the dog loses hair at the base of the tail and it looks very strange. You can solve this problem by easy straightforward steps. Give your dog a regular bath. Which shampoo or soap to use while dog bath? Taking a suggestion from a veterinarian is a good idea. Use only medicated collars and leashes for your dog. Gets the dog's skin checked on regular basis why by the veterinarian. If you do not take this problem why do puppies bite their tails seriously, then the condition can get worse. The dog may start crying or whining from the pain and itching. Just like humans, dogs are also have to many types of allergies. Dogs can get allergies from the external environment as well. Check the side of your house to see if there are any chemicals kept. Apart from this, dogs can get an allergy from the food you feed them. A good step definitely will be to get the dog allergy tested by the veterinarian. The veterinarian will be able to tell you about dog allergies and definitely understand your dog's problem. What type of allergy your dog is infected with, the veterinarian will explain the medical solution better. Please check the type of food you're giving to your dog for regular consumption. Examine the food products used for your dog. The product should not harmful to your dog's skin, such as a dog belt, collar, or shampoo. This allergy causes itchy skin in your dog. As we, humans feel anxiety and stress. Similarly, our most trusted animal dog can also have problems with anxiety and stress. It can also be the stress of separation from its owner. There can also be anxiety about being alone. Being under stress and worry can lead to aggression in their behavior. Because of which he can start biting or chewing his tail. Some dogs keep slicking base of tail due to excessive itching. For resolve this issue, take your dog outside for exercise regularly. Encourage the dog to run. Play physical games with him like to chase up the ball. So that the dog's attention will be diverted to the other side. Due to the tired body, dog will be able to sleep comfortably. This effort will drain out your dog's extra energy and stress. The dog's confidence will increase in the dog owner. As a result, your dog will get rid of his stress and anxiety issues. It is possible that a hot spot has developed on dog's body skin. Due to that dog keeps biting and chewing repeatedly at that hot spot. Due to the constant biting and chewing of the dog, a wound develops at that location. These hot spots develop on the skin of dogs or puppies in an environment of moisture and heat. Whenever you see your dog constantly biting and munching his tail, it is possible that a hot spot has formed on your dog's tail. Your dog bites and nibbles on its tail frequently to give itself a rest and to relieve itching. You can easily identify the presence of hot spots on the dog's skin. If your dog has matted hair on his body, lack of hair in one spot, presence of blood or pus, 
scabs or red colored skin, irritated skin are the main symptoms. The solution to this problem will definitely be found at your veterinarian. Contact the veterinarian and understand the treatment of this disease of the dog. Your dog may be biting or chewing on his tail because of his anal glands being impacted. It is very important for your dog or another dog that their anal glands remain healthy. When these anal glands are healthy, dogs know other dogs and let other dogs know themselves. Dogs in their social lives secrete fluid from the anal glands, which other dogs will smell when they meet. Other signs of impacted anal glands are constipation or the dog rubbing his butt against the ground. These are signs that your dog has affected anal glands. If blood or pus starts to come from your dog's stool, then your dog's anal glands are seriously impacted. In this situation, you cannot cure this problem with home remedies. It is better that you contact a veterinarian. Your beloved dog may injure its tail while playing or for other reasons. In case of injury, it may cause itching and dog biting tail continuously. Another reason for biting or chewing your tail can be a fracture of the tail. Your dog biting tail and choose to get relief from the pain. If any of the above conditions are confirmed, you should contact your nearest veterinarian with your dog. The dog has always been the first choice in the domestic pet for humans. The main reason for this is the intelligent and friendly behavior of dogs. But just like us humans, many types of physical diseases keep happening in dogs too. Such as allergies, infection from the external environment or chemicals, constipation, sadness, and anxiety. As a result of all these diseases, there is bound to be a change in the behavior of dogs. Hope you found this information helpful as a dog owner. We have tried our best to give information about problem and solution related to dog's tail. If you want any more information related to dog or puppy, then please tell us by writing in the comment box. Please subscribe our channel to have videos like this. You can also visit our website for written information. Our website www.dogtoysandaccessories.com Thanks you and keep safe.